have our, our entry level Strebig compact machine. Like all Strebig vertical panel saws, we can cut both vertically and horizontally from either the primary rolling surface at the bottom or as our parts get cut down to smaller sizes, we can lift up our center shelf and set it down on there and work at a nice comfortable height. Cutting vertically is very, very simple. We lock ourselves into a vertical station and set a measurement from that point. Simply roll the panel easily once again over to that stop and make a perfectly square cut because the beam is locked both at the top and the bottom of the machine into the V-channels, top and bottom, guaranteeing my, my perfect squareness. When I want to cut horizontally, I simply pivot the saw head, unlock myself from the vertical cutting station, roll the panel down to the end stop. Did I kick up? Mm -hmm. Let the panel rest against it. Set my measurement on my scales on the front of the saw my saw head and make my cut. And we're always making a cut in a stationary panel with a very precisely guided saw and not having to move material through the saw. We have our top of the line Strebig control model where many of the setup functions are automated or semi-automatic and the travel of the machine is fully automatic. In setting up the cut, I can pivot from vertical to horizontal and I do most of my controlling from the touch screen here. It has a nice feature that can locate the top of the panel and position itself for a trim cut. A laser dot on the board is locating the top of the panel and positioning itself. Uh, in this case, for a trim cut that I prescribed of a quarter of an inch. Hitting start, and the saw goes to the position I described, and we can make that cut automatically as well. Again, if I want to pivot the saw head into vertical position, I do it simply at the push of a button. And here comes the stop, moving into place. I would then, again, easily roll my panel into position, put the saw head into a starting position, the saw head comes back only as high as where we last started the cut, in both vertical and horizontal modes. It will sense the end of the panel, stop there, and return to the starting point.